So I come out here in my garage to talk about DIY, do it yourself. <clears throat> so I don't know if anybody knows this. <laughs> I don't know if Lowe's does this, but Home Depot has this magical bin at the end of the lumber yard that's marked 70% off. And they spray the stuff with purple so that you automatically know that it's 70% off. I'll show you. Sometimes it's not in the bin, it's right by the bin. They give it a little magic, little magic. Boom, 70% off. And honestly, I was like, shit, why don't I just go in here with a purple spray can? And they were like, people have tried. I'm like, I bet when you're walking out with Primo stuff and you got it sprayed purple, it kind of seems like the gig is up. So anyhow, I was there and I stopped. Every time I go there, I go and I stop. Cause you never know. They have trim, they have two by fours. Christ my, there was a 16 foot four by four in there, pressure treated. I don't have any use for it, but I almost picked it up because why not? You cut it in two and you can lay something on it outside. It was like, it's, everything's 70% off. I got these six by, two by sixes for 70% off. I am sons of bitches. You know, 10 footers. They're $8, I got them for what, three? This was a good steal last week though. MDF, $23 a sheet. Had this little bit of rust on it. I've been using this to make trim, all kind of shit. I made the side panel for my dishwasher, everything. Paint's nice, you can't beat it, right? Just don't hold a screw. Glue it up, do what you gotta do, but don't screw it to screw it, just put a board behind it. But anyhow, what I'm getting at is, if you do any kind of crafts, go to this bin and look. Like last year, I made wine boxes. Well, I took two by sixes, split them in twain, planed them, jointed them, boom, straight lumber. Out of garbage wood that was like for framing, I made nice wood. Which, if you go get pine that's primo pine, you're going to pay through the nose for pine. Like, go get yourself a 2 by 12 The bigger the board, the better the wood that's going to be in there that you can make. And, you know, it's, I don't know, you know. You always keep wood on hand. I feel like you, every human being, or every dude at least, who does any kind of shit around the house, should have at least 10 2 by 4s on standby at all times. Because you never know. You never know. Like, look, I got all this crap here I keep there. Keep everything. All my scraps I throw on here so I'm not sitting on the ground. All my plywood, OSB, everything. I'm pretty sure, oh, look, look, look. I even got an LVL floating around in here. <laughs> you just you never know when you're gonna need to drop an LVL in, huh? You know, you set your workshop up, you're all ready to good to go, you know? I didn't buy this all at once, I just nickel and dime it, you know? Buy some here, buy some there. Put a table up here, put a table up there. Before you know it, boom, you're making furniture. You know, you're like Mr. Handy. Like me. All right.